here we have the distance formula. And the distance formula tells us the distance between two points, so how far away they are from one another. And here we have an example with two points. So the first point, point 1, has coordinates 2 and 5, but we can also refer to those coordinates as x1 and y1. Similarly, the second point we can think of as x2, y2. So all we need to do now is substitute those x2, y2, x1, y1 into our distance formula. So let's just put them in to start. So x1, 2, subtract x2, and we square that. Then we add y1, 5, minus negative 3, that's y2, and all of that is squared. So to, to work this out now, we need to think about order of operations and what to do first. So the first thing we want to do is look at what's inside these brackets. So 2 minus 4 is negative 2. In our second bracket here, we have 5 minus negative 3, which we can think of as 5 plus 3. So 5 plus 3, 8. And we remember to continue along squaring and taking the square root of everything. So our next step now is to work with the exponents. So now we're going to take negative 2 and square it, which makes 4. Next, we're going to take 8 and square that, 64. Finally, we're going to add what's underneath the square root. So 4 plus 64 is 68. So either you could be finished with a step, or you could use your calculator to figure out the answer in decimals, which would be 8.25. And that is how you use the distance formula.